Don, would you like to do a little governor off? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Uh, before you flip it off, just roll the RPMs. We can keep our speed up. But uh, roll the RPMs down to the, like the middle of the green. Um, I would probably do it like a, right, right around 100%. That way, if you do have any oscillations, you're not going to overspeed. Okay, just like right about here. Sure. Just go ahead and yep. flip it off. Bring those RPMs down a little bit. There we go. And then now they're going to stay there, so let's just go back up to our normal cruise speed. Okay. In fact, so they really don't vary much. No, is what you're saying. You just have to watch out so they don't overspeed. Yeah. So, okay. uh, if you want, go ahead and just slowly roll down. Uh, watch your trim here. Go ahead and roll down to like 92 percent. Okay. Just listen and watch, but I'll keep an eye out for aircraft. Hear the change in pitch, or like the oh, blade yeah. just... Oh yeah, just just the difference, a whole different feeling in the ship. Now let's try to maintain this altitude. You're gonna have to bring in some power here. This would basically be at a uh, max glide configuration as far as for your rotor RPM, uh -huh. 90, 90%. See, now we're holding RPMs. Yeah. And you almost have full. And we're about 20 inches on manifold. Yeah. Now, let's and we are maintaining. And we are maintaining 65 knots. You can bring it back up. I don't really care what you do. Just, just be a good low RPM recovery. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's something we needed to do. Yeah. Pretty simple. Okay. Governor on. Let's go refuel. All right. Rolling up. Ooh. Um, turn the, let's turn the governor off. Governor off. And do it. Now do it. Okay. Now we're going to roll it up to 90%. And, uh... Just hold it at 90, and then when you bring the correlator up, or the collective up, the correlator will naturally bring it in. Oh, yeah. If we brought it up to 100% now, yeah. bring it up to 95%, or do you want to? Just I want to try it right here. Okay. All right, I'm going to bring it up. Oh, yeah. See? Gotcha. By the, time that, by the time the blades get a good amount of drag on them, your RPMs are in the green. So if we start at 100%, we, now we need, may need to roll down just a little bit. Okay, yeah. There we Bring go. Bring it up a little more. That's perfect. We don't have to be right in the green on this So one. do you want to taxi down this way? Yeah. Okay. Give you more of a workout. Now don't, yeah, don't fixate too much on that gauge. Hey, you are giving me a workout. I am. But see, if we had started, let's bring the RPMs down just a little okay. bit, Don. Bring it down just a little bit more. There we go. Now, from this point on, you can just simply fly. If okay. we had uh, brought it up to 100% before yeah. we brought the, you know, started bringing in the collective, yeah. then we would have really, we would have had to have rolled the throttle down a lot to prevent it from overspeeding. Because there was no, there's no drag on the blades, yet you're introducing more fuel to compensate for that. And the gov there's no governor to right. roll, naturally okay. roll it down. Yep, gotcha. Makes sense. So really, you're flying a, a Hughes or a Schweitzer right now. Mm-hmm. That's not all that bad, is it? No, it's, it's re it really isn't. And I think the uh, even on the Schweitzers, I've never flown one, but uh, there's even more of a leeway as far as you have a, a much bigger arc for you know normal operating. Uh, now we're getting the wind effect. Look at there. Yeah, where the wind's coming from? Oh, right off of our left border. A little bit more of oscillations. 
definitely. Look at that. Yep. Doing good, Don. Not many people do this much governor off work. Most of the time it's like, all right, flip it off in flight. Oh, good job, flip it back on. Now you say, oh, it's like. But this is, the in-flight stuff isn't what gets you. It's the, you know. Emergency stuff. Well, like with the governor off, yeah, it's usually, you know, the approaches, pickups, takeoffs, because um, that's where your, your biggest power changes are, and that's what would require you to do the most uh, throttle changes.